Hey guys, Chef Ro here. Welcome to our next video in the series. I'm not saying you're doing it wrong, but today I'm going to use a vegetable that I personally love, but I think that a lot of people have never been taught how to properly handle it. I'm going to use some snow peas. Now, most people think, oh, snow peas, no big deal. Just toss them in a pan, saute them up. Delicious, right? The problem is, is that they forget to remove the strings and then they get stuck in your teeth and it's just not a pleasant experience. So, it's very simple. Whenever you work with your snow peas, all you're going to do is see this little string right here. You're going to take that and you're just going to pull it across the top. Then there's another one on the underside too. So you just snap off this really rough end, which doesn't seem edible anyway, and you're going to pull down that way also. So, now you've got both strings on your snow pea off. It's a little bit tedious, but I assure you that the effort's going to be worth it. Okay, I've gone ahead and de-stringed my entire stack of snow peas, and you can see all of this pile of stuff that, quite frankly, is just texturally inappropriate. So, make sure you de-string your snow peas, and then they're ready to saute, uh, stir fry, however you want to use them. You can use them in salads, just raw. They're perfectly great to eat. I use sometimes use them in sushi. Um, you can use them for anything. But make sure you de-string them first, because I'm not saying you've been doing it wrong, but 